Zynga. Okay, what I'm doing is I'm going to show you today uh, the follow-up to the Showbox, which is the eyeball, and now I'm going to go into Cody. There is a lot to be said about this. What this looks like right here is the K. What this actually is, is it's kind of like a housing for your repos, which is a repository of applications. Now on this box, these applications link you to third-party servers, which give you all of your streaming for free. So when you go into this, what I want to cover initially in this is the home screen. This is what comes up. And this is what it looks like. Okay, so what these are is these are shortcuts. Okay, all these right here. You've got your TV shows, you've got your movies, your news, sports pay-per-view, your add-ons, and then your Android. Now, as you can see up here at the top, all these are applications. Okay, and these are applications that are over here that are sports and pay-per-view. Your news, if you look up top, those are all ones that you go to. The TV shows has some on there, and also your movies has some on there. Now, I want to kind of give you an idea of why these have been put on here. For the experienced user, okay, that's been using this for a long time, for two or three years, or however many years that is, what they know is that people will go into the main section of this. So these are only a couple. So by sliding over to your add-ons and going into this video section right here, you will see, boom, all these pop up. So these are a lot of the applications that you have at your access. Okay, and we've only put a few of them outside here. Now, to give you an understanding of what that shortcut out here on this home screen is, I'm going to tell you why. Okay, over here in movies, you have featured, latest releases, the new screeners, 1080p, 720, 3D movies. So these are some of the ones that are in the shortcut. Now, the reason these have been put on here and where these come from is like this. A lot of people don't want to watch something that's in cam or something like that. So what they'll do is they'll go into, let's say, the video and they'll go in here under the add-on section and they will go to let's say mashup I'm gonna use that as an example so right here is mashup so a lot of people that are experienced users they'll use this mashup which went down recently and a lot of the links aren't working in there but we have it up and running so what they'll do is they'll go over here to the super movie so remember now we've gone into the to the uh, add-on section we've gone into mashup now I'm going into super movies inside of mashup now I'm going to HD releases so HD releases that's one of the shortcuts that you see out there listed so instead of having to go all the way over into here into mashup and then going into super movies and then going into HD releases that's one of the headings that you find out there so this is what this is. These are all movies which a lot of them are brand new. This is where you want to go. Excuse me, that's not what I want to do, but this is where you want to go, okay? So people know when they come in here that they just want the movies that have come out on the HD releases. So that's the reason for the shortcut. So you can be out here and go directly to that, okay? And and this applies to all the apps. This 1080p is in another app. It's somewhere buried deep in another app that you go into. So what we've done is we bought all these to the forefront to where all you can do is you can click on it like this, give it a second to sit here and load because it's going into that application and opening quite a few windows to go in there and pull this up. So as you see, it pulls all these up. So it's a shortcut so you don't have to go in and then into another spot inside of that app and then into another one to pull these out of there like that. So it's actually pretty good. We've chosen the best ones that we can so you can go into it right there and not have to go through all that. The same thing applies over here to the TV shows. When you're going to, you know, My Favorites or Simply Movies, stuff like that, the Entertainment Hub or DocuHub, 
these are the ones that have been chosen for that. Earth Cam, the Food Network, Film On, Kids Zone, Stand Up Comedy. These can be customized by the person themselves, but that you got to be a little tech savvy to do that. Now, this First Row Sports EU under the Sports and Pay Per View is one that is inside of this app right here, the Sports Devil. So if I was going to go into the Sports Devil, just let's say randomly, I'll show you why that's been put out front. So now you'll go into Sports Devil, you'll go into the Live Sports, and then here is the First Row EU. So instead of having to go into that and pick this, the First Row EU, which is kind of popular because it gives you access to you know the American football, the boxing, WWE, UFC, football which is actually the soccer, basketball, hockey and all your games like I said before it's been put out here onto this screen so these are what the shortcuts are it's it's us going into the apps choosing the spots where most people go and putting them out here for your use so you don't have to go into that so, so that's kind of the understanding now if you want to go into the other places inside of this add-on section over here on the right into the video it brings you into there and you have you know numerous apps that do numerous things including you know YouTube's, your Vivos, uh, just about anything that you're looking for can be found but if you take a look up here at the top this Phoenix, this Mashup, this Prime Wire, this Movies 25, and this iStream if you're gonna go into any one of these the layout is pretty simple on all of these you will click on them or you can go into your add-on section right there to movies and go down to it yourself and you'll see this you'll see movies TV shows the playlist or whatever what you're gonna be looking for the majority of the time if you're not just going to the HD releases for the movies if you're looking for a show or a particular movie you can click on it and then you'll want to go all the way down or wherever it's at and go to the search bar when you go to this search bar you type in whatever it is that you're looking for so all of these have this so you're looking at applications that are doing the same things a lot of them have you know just about the same content inside of them so if you go to one and it's not there you just, just choose another one and go into it go into a search bar type in the name of your show and keep in mind that it has to be exactly right so you need to have your spelling right and you need to know how it's spelled for your show like uh, the other day I was looking for fast and loud and I typed in fast and then the word and loud and I couldn't find it anywhere and I was like this isn't right so what I realized is I looked it up on the internet and found out that it was spelled fast and then an N and then loud and I put it in and it popped up on all the sites so make sure that you're going in here and typing in the right thing or the right way that it's supposed to be spelled. You can't just shortcut and kind of just mosey through it. Now movies, same thing, you got this, latest added, features, favorites, but the same thing, you've got your search with the description so you can type in the name of your movie. A lot of times people will go into the featured or the most popular. Now you can do this in all of them. A lot of the times you'll want to look for the HD releases inside of here or newly released or whatever it may be that you're looking for so you have you know this and this and this these are some of the things that have come out that are inside of these apps again these will be in all of these applications that you see up there so the shortcuts have been put up here to kind of give you an idea of where you want to go when you're you know inside of this once you become more experienced and you've pretty much mastered those which will not take you that long you can see that you know there's break.com, you got click, crackle, you got the easy news and a lot of the other things in here that you don't necessarily see out there. They could be put out there, but again, you'd have to be tech savvy if you're at home doing it yourself. Your YouTube is in here. Um, so if you wanted to see YouTube, you could go to that or whatever it is. So this is just the basic tutorial on you know your home screen and why it's set up that way and what those mean when you're going into that so now you know that those are shortcuts leading inside of these apps that take you to some of the best parts of it that we find that most people use and go to all over the world